Hey, what's up guys? My name is Achano and welcome to Shadow. So Shadow is the game that I made over this weekend for Ladum Dare. In case you didn't know, Ladum Dare is like a 48 hour game programming competition in which you have 48 hours to make a game based on a particular theme. The theme this time was you only get one. Um, and of course my game here, which is called Shadow, which you can uh, find the, the link to download the game for either Windows, Mac or Linux, it works on all of them. Uh, you'll find that link in the description, that's actually the Ladum competition like entry page, so you'll find the description there as well. Um, and you will also find the source code there on that page as well, because one of the requirements of course of Ladum there is of the competition portion of that is to release the source code, so go ahead play around with that. Now uh, this game, so Basically, the idea that the idea behind this game is you only get one bullet. Uh, you are that green little cube that you see, and you are you have to, you're basically the the last I guess survivor left in the world here, and um, and and all these guys, uh, all these red cubes are basically just infected cubes. So they're not only zombies or anything; they're just kind of infected. Um, and uh, of course, your idea is to survive as long as you can. Now, um, you only have one bullet left in your in your trusty pistol, but uh, but you can always collect that bullet. So once you shoot it, if you miss, you hit a wall. You will hit a wall because the map is surrounded by walls. Um, if you hit a wall, you can just walk up to it, collect that bullet back, and you have that bullet. Um, you can also, if you always, if you kill one of them, they kind of drop a bullet. It's a bit different. You can see that it drops like a bullet that kind of spins around with a nice bouncy kind of animation. Um, so yeah, anyway, I did live stream this entire thing on twitch.tv forward slash the Cherno over that weekend, which was December 14th to 16th for me in Australia. Um, and yeah, I mean, I'm pretty happy with what I ended up with. It was a bit of a, like, I didn't spend a lot of time on the actual game because I had I had one goal, kind of. I wanted to, I wanted to make sure that my LWJGL applets actually worked. Um, needless to say, they didn't. Um, by the end of that, I, I think I spent about nine hours, not nine hours, probably about five hours uh, on the on Sunday morning um, trying to figure out, like, what's up. And I mean, I got pretty far, but I just couldn't load any resources, unfortunately, into the game. So, um, the, my LWJGL applets did work, but without resources, and that was a problem because I couldn't use textures or music. Uh, also, the music you're hearing is from the game, of course. Um, I might actually put up the... I think it took me like a, an hour and ten minutes in total to write the music for this and to produce it. I might put that up as a video just because that's like the only portion of development I can put up since um, the rest is covered with copyrighted music that I was listening to while programming. So if you guys are interested in that, I might put that up as a video on this channel. But um, apart from that, make sure you play the game. The game's made in OpenGL and LW, LWJGL. And I hope you guys enjoy it. So I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. I'll put up a time lapse soon as well. So yeah, later guys.